In this video, I'm going to show you how to change currency from US dollar to ZA or South African Rand on Xness. So first of all, what you need to do is that you want to go ahead and log in into your Xness account. So to do that, you can open any browser and basically search for Xness login. And basically, you're going to see the official Xness website right here. And once you come right here, you want to click on Xness login. And basically, this is going to take you to the Xness official sign in page. And what you need to do here is that you just need to go ahead and log in with your email and your password. So basically, I'm just going to do that. And then you click on continue to log in. So basically, after you've logged in, if you actually go to my accounts right here, and basically, if you scroll down to see your existing accounts, if you click on more on these three doors right here, you're actually going to see that there is no option that can allow you to change the currency of an existing account. So the only option that you have is that you can create a new account under the currency that you now want to use. So basically, what you need to do is that you just need to go ahead and click on this plus icon on open account at the top right here. And basically, just create a new account in the currency that you want. In this case, we want to create an account with the South African Rand as the currency, which is ZA. Uh, so what you need to do once you come right here, the first thing is to choose the platform that you want the account to be. So either you want MT4 or MT5. So if you want MT5, you just need to go ahead and choose MT5 right here. And basically once you come right here, you just need to go ahead and choose the account type that you want to create. So you can create a standard account or a pro account or a raw spread account or a zero a professional account or a standard sent account so in this case we're just going to create a standard account so once you do that you just need to go ahead and click on continue right here and basically this is going to take you to this particular page where you need to set things like leverage so the first thing uh, to do is to come right here on leverage and click right here on this arrow that is pointing at the downside and basically go ahead and choose the leverage that you want in my case i want the one as to 500 because this is the perfect uh leverage uh for the instruments that i want to trade so once you do that now the most important thing is that you want to come right here on currency and basically go ahead and click on uh this arrow right here and basically what you just need to do right here is to search for the currency that you now want to use right so you just need to go ahead and search for the currency. And in this case, we want the South African Rand, which is the ZAR. So you just need to go ahead and search for it right here. So as you can see down right here, we have the South African Rand, the ZAR. So basically just choose it and tap on it just like that. And once you do that, the next thing that you just need to do is to go ahead and type a password that you want for your account. So to do that, you just need to go ahead and tap on this tab right here and basically type your password so i'm just going to do that so you do the same so basically once you're done you just need to go ahead and click on create account at the bottom right here and basically that's going to create your account as you can see right here we now have our za account so basically now what you can do is that just need to go ahead and deposit money into this new account that you want to use under new currency which is the south african run the za or what you can do is that you can just transfer money from your previous accounts that you had into the new account right here so you can see here you have many options uh the deposit the withdraw option and if you click on these three dots right here basically right here this is where you can assess the feature to transfer funds right here and also right here you can change the leverage if you later on want to change things like leverage and all those kind of things and right here as well you have an option to change the trading password if you feel like you want to change the password in the future so if you want to go ahead and get information about the uh, account right here in terms of like if you want to go ahead and log in into your mt5 just go ahead and come right here on account information and basically this is where you're going to find your account number and basically the server and as you can see right here this is our mt5 login and our server and what you just need to do is that to copy this information and then you go on mt5 and basically just go ahead and log in into your account using the password that you've created so basically guys that's how you can actually change the currency from us dollar to za on xness